Hi, my name is Bira and I make books for kids. Today, I want to talk to you about Asha, the main character in my picture book, The Yellow Suitcase. Tell us about your character. Asha is a little girl and she's very close to her grandma. But one day, grandma dies and Asha is devastated. Growing up, I was very close to my grandfather. And when he passed away, just like Asha, I was very upset. My grandparents' home was not too far, and I remember attending part of his funeral with my family. However, in this story, Asha lives in California, and her grandma's house that she visited every summer is in India. And when Asha gets to India, Asha is completely lost because grandma is not there. The place and people feel strange this time without grandma and the customs and how they say goodbye to a loved one is also different from what Asha has seen in America. Asha is confused and she misses grandma even more. I remember having many questions and complicated feelings about my grandfather's death. And when I was creating Asha, I was thinking about what it takes to help us especially kids like you, feel better when we miss someone we dearly love. My favorite thing about Asha is how she expresses her emotions. She puts thoughts into words, and that sometimes helps her process a difficult situation. What made you want to become a creator of books? I wanted to write books because I think stories are very powerful. They can make you laugh, cry, imagine, travel and think. Sometimes they can even make you change the way you think about something or someone. So through my stories, I like to believe that I'm doing an important job in shaping the minds of children like you in a positive way. As a kid growing up in India, I read a lot of stories set in Europe and America. Or if they were set in India, they were myths with kings and demons or tales with animals and forests. I do not see kids like myself in my, most stories, both on how the kids looked or how they lived. So when I wanted to write, I wanted to write stories for children in America who do not see themselves or their lives in the books they read. If you found a whale in your bathtub, what would you do? I don't like bats, so I'll fill the tub I'll get ready for a nice warm shower from the whale's blow.